New design ideas are being considered for Santa Barbara State Street. And News Channel reporter John Palmateri joins us now live. And John, these come with mixed reviews and even some old complaints. The State Street Advisory Committee has seen new concept drawings again about what could happen in downtown Santa Barbara and what it could mean to the future of State Street down here. State Street doesn't know what it is. The districts don't know what they are. After months of studies, there are still frustrations when the State Street Advisory Committee meets. Wide-ranging ideas for the promenade are now evolving. It may take on a look with these just-released design features for dining, pedestrians, bikes, and a transit shuttle. But these drawings raised questions about the city's historic look. This design could be anywhere in California, and it can be anywhere in the United States. If you close your eyes and open it and see a slice of any of the things that we've seen, that could be placed in any town. We never, never start dealing with it like it's a space to do something with. We always start with a street. And then what do we do with the street and all that that means? The project consultant says some of his suggestions to redesign and revitalize State Street have been used successfully in other cities. While there are so many components to the look of State Street downtown now and in the future, there's a line of thinking to possibly take the project in sections instead of doing the entire promenade all at once. Mixing bikes and pedestrians remains a big issue for many people, including some that will not walk in the open street. We have to address the bike speeds. This is for everyone's safety. These are kids that are going 35 miles per hour. I would like to have seen a, a, at least two block area of pedestrian only, and I'm sorry, Bicyclists, you got a lot going on in the plan. You can walk two blocks. One downtown worker who has had close calls agreed. Yeah, yeah. slowing them down. Yeah. And for the ones who that do go really fast, the ones that was uh, those bikes, uh, they should really have a license or a helmet. When it comes to the economic or aesthetic future of this core section of downtown, it's an evolving process the State Street Committee has set out to deal with. You know, you open up the street traffic, you have more people driving in, parking, and then walking. If you close it off, then they're parking somewhere else, and it depends on where they're walked to. I mean, a lot of these stores are going out of business. I wish it would just th remain as much as like it was forever. I mean, the old, old Santa Barbara. I, I dig old Santa Barbara. And both the State Street committee members and the consultant that was hired were solution oriented when they got to some of these sticking points with some fresh ideas going forward. They'll meet again next month, but nobody said go back to the way it was before the pandemic and start there and go forward. They're going to work with what they have here. Reporting live in the Promenade in downtown Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter John Palmenteri.